Are you new to homesteading? Are you thinking about how to be more self-reliant? Interested in how to raise animals? How to grow your own food? Or how to preserve food? Do you like the outdoors? Do you like pets? Do you like animals? Then welcome to Ranger Rob Country Living. Join Sherry and Rob as we learn new things, new equipment, and new techniques. Sometimes we have great fails and great success. But most of all, we're trying. So hit that subscribe button and let's get started. Hey everybody, this is Ranger Rob. Welcome to the channel. I want to welcome all the new subscribers. And uh, I'm still working on the plumbing for the hydroponic Dutch bucket system. And it's how to deal with my three inch pipe. So the three inch pipe is right here. This big stuff here. And what this is, is going to be the drain for all these dust buckets. So uh, let me show you my dilemma real quick. Is uh, along the edging will be my three inch pipe. Each one of these uh, buckets will drain into the pipe and then drain into the tank again and return the water. So the dilemma is, is the three inch pipe has to have a down slope all the way to the bucket. So trying to figure out how I was going to do that. So I'm going to utilize these clamps and I'm going to make little two by four fittings and attach them to this and make this adjustable on it. And so basically I'll have to kind of show you what it looks like when I'm done. But uh, I'm going to get that started today. I did buy some nuts and bolts to, to fit what I want to do. And my original idea was to hang the pipes using a, a deal like this that goes up to the top. Problem is, the string's too long, too short. And I didn't mind buying those because I also use those to string my uh, my uh, growing lights. So that was a fail. <laughs> so I think I have a winner. So I'm going to go build four prototypes and then we're going to install them and see how Here's they work see how they work Alright guys, I got my mock-up uh, brackets completed. I just made four of them to go over here. I'm going to install them and then I'll test them out. Alright guys, so I uh, installed these. So I got them right there. One down there. And one at the end. And I can do the same around the corner and everything. What's nice about this is I can adjust the height so I can give uh, the pipe a slope. Now on this side, instead of putting those on the top, 
I can put them at the bottom and actually lower it even more. And I'm going to drain out the back here. So, uh, anyway, I think that'll work. I'm going to grab a three inch pipe and see if I can get it in there. And voila, and just a couple of minutes later, there's the pipe as it'll go along the sides here. These guys here will drain right into the holes here that I got to drill. And I got a splice here. I need to put a 90 degree here and around the corner. I think that's going to work <coughs> until it doesn't. We'll see. Okay, guys. Well, I assembled some more. So I did a total of eight. That should actually do the whole project. The only problem is, is I didn't get enough washers. So I got to dig through the garage and find some washers. But in the meantime, I'm going to wrap it up right here. I want to thank you very much for watching. Uh, all the new subscribers, welcome aboard. It's really nice to have you. Everybody, if you would, take the time to like, share, uh, you know, uh, subscribe, all that good stuff. We'd appreciate it. Uh, until next time, guys, have a great day and be safe. Bye now. Our videos are made possible by Ranger Rob Poopy Bags. Available at Amazon right now. Thank you very much for watching our video. Please take the time to like, subscribe, and share our videos all over the whole wide world. Thanks.